Dok, ang global court lumamang na kanina yan ng hanggang labing tatlong puntos pero isang isap mata lang inubos na halos ng token text yan hindi kang pa to come to within one make that coming to within two after that but that well like I said uh, yung team na yan is a very strong offensive team and once they get their defense and force you to miss you know, they can easily get themselves back in the ball game that's a three point attempt by Bring and that was nothing but net Atin sa atin yan ang PLDD Home Devolution turns your ordinary TV into an internet TV. Sa puntong ito, makibalita tayo kay Ms. Risa Diaz. Mago from Coach Jong Wichigo, they have to do a better job at controlling the guards of Global Port Batang Pier, citing 17 points of their turnovers. Each and every time they make a mistake, they run. So if they do a better job on that, they will be more control of this game. Mago? Yun niya kanina, no? ginagamit nila kanina yung mga outlet pass dok na kadalawang yeah. nakaw sila ng mga ganun-ganun. Well, for Rani Gell and ano. Pero ito si Isip has come in to play no. against Pettigrew for the first time. And he had boxed him out on the first play. Kaya nga naka-Isip two points. Ngayon na, goal tending naman na natawagan si Famous. Romeo. Trying to create that space. Isip to sa loob. Pringle. Is fouled on the way to the cup. Coach Pito Arenzo trying to give Pettigrew different looks so far in this game. Though. Yeah, uh, use your big man. You got uh, Amarel, you got Doug Kramer, you got Jensen. Now you're using Isip. Pero tignan mo yung ginagawa talaga ni Pringle. That's what you always look for in your guards. Eh? Because maraming bola na tatapik. And those are the guys, he's the guy that's been picking up the 50-50 ball. Unang free throw ni Pringle, pasok at it's atin yan. Nang smart, live more. Ali Pringle off the bench. Only his fourth game for Global Port this tournament sa ika-anim nilang outing. Meron na siyang labing limang puntos. And he has five points here in this, uh, at the start of the third quarter. Lima ang abante rito ng Batang Pierre. They sport a 3-2 and two record. 3-1 naman ang tropa. Douglas on the attack. Gets it over to carry. The shot put. Could not connect. Easy para sa board. Pringle pushing it once again. Look at the explosion into the front court. Pupunta muna siya kay Semerad. Pringle and Semerad are with Easy, Romeo, and Famous. Semerad from the outside delivers the long ball. At ang puntos nagagaling kay Pringle. Either he's scoring or he's passing and making the assist pass. Three-point shot na yan at it's atin ng PLDT on Devolution. Turns your ordinary TV into an internet TV. Douglas Papawe! Nakuha naman! Well, again, Isip didn't show hard there in that play. He didn't expect Douglas to throw up. That would be the eighth three-point shot for Tok and Tex. While Global Array has made seven in this ballgame. Ika-apat naman yan para dito kay Sam, Sam Douglas. Douglas. He's Four feeling, he's so feeling it tonight. Romeo looks away, attacks Bonacher. Romeo ball fakes it, out to Pringle. The Ubra. Carry rebound, Bonacher, ang magtatawid. Si Larry, magaling dumipensa yan. Hindi kumakagat sa mga shot fake yan. Hindi mo mapapatalo niya, nakataas lang ang kamay niya. Pettigrew on that baseline, that should be goaltending. And it is. Umanda na eh, no? Bago inabot ni Pavlos. What I know about Global is they have a limit where they won two games, right? And then uh, two, two or three games, and then they change. To Stephen Thomas, then who was uh, supposed to be a temporary thing for Famous. First import nila was uh, Patrick O'Brien Doc, and they they were two and zero with him. Yeah. And then ke Thomas, Stephen yata, Thomas, na kawan ng isang laro na panalo, no? Na one and one. One and one. Tapos dito kay Famous. Zero and one so far. Kulang pa ang kanyang uh, ginagawa for a big import with the kind of lineup that they have. Kailangan pa magpasigat? Yeah, I mean, I think he, he has to use his... He really is not a power player. Yan ang yeah. problema niya. Yung Steven Thomas, inaasahan nila kung saan na yung power player dahil nga uh, balik import na yun. Ano? Dating nakapagdala na rin sa F21 but, sa finals. Yeah, actually, they played against Ginebra in that championship. Na, but that was long ago. And then he went to the ABC group. You like Thomas, really just got to, uh, this guy uh, famous. He's got to do a lot more of those. So. Gary carving out some space. Harvey making away. And then you make a turnover like that. That really hurts.
Falk and Thex slowly but surely catching up with Global Port in this third quarter of action. Doug Kramer back on the floor. Pinalitan muna si Famous. Well, nakita ni Pino Harencio, he was not happy with the effort of Famous. No? Except for the shot that he made defensively, plus the turnover. You know, he's not really been doing the job that they expect him to do. And coach, and now manager Bonitan, talking to him. No? Carey ties the game at 68. Ikatlong deadlock na yan. Ang gabing ito. Pringle to Romeo. Batang Pierre looking to reclaim the lead. Romeo against Douglas gets a half step on him but runs into carry. Douglas had a hand on it. Mananatili ang possession sa global court pero tatatong segundo na lang sa kanila shot clock. Let's see what kind of baseline play they run here. Tight ball game at 68 all. Kramer on the catch. Somebody's got to put it up. They did not realize the shot clock was winding down. Munti Gamba para kay Pringle. Kramer puts it up and in. Good substitution there for Pido because Kramer you know, always, his mind is always in the game, no? And he saw that ball going up in the air. There was a chance for an offensive rebound, and he went for it. Ten points in the game now, para dito kay Doug. Pettigrew, gusto bumawe, spinning against Mamaril. Billy not backing down. Pettigrew earning for himself a trip to the line for two shots as we send it over to Miss Reza. Magu, Global Port is being honest. Nakukulangan sila sa nakikita nila from Jared Famous. So far in this game, he's only had nine rebounds and eight points. Last week though, I'm excuse dahil from the States, diretso Dubai at naglaro. But from Dubai, pinakapagpahintay niya na to. Pagbalik nga dito sa Pilipinas. So they expect him to actually play stronger, give a little more effort and hustle because that's what he's famous. Thank you, Ms. Riza. A three-point shot pa doon si Pettigrew. The other shot clock running down and he was aware of it. Pag siyam na three-point shot kaya ng talk and text. Romeo nagpakawala. Bam! That's his favorite play. When he comes off of curl, down screen curl, gets himself ready for the jump shot. Douglas with the leather. Goes to carry. Lead is back with Global Port. Douglas to carry off the reverse. And Douglas is a complete player. Talagang very experienced. Knows how to play the pick and roll with his teammates and give off that pass very quickly. Right on the money ang kanyang pass. Romeo nagigipagsayaw dito kay Panacher. Terrence gives it up. Pringle from deep. Couldn't send it home. Washington taps it over. Papunta kay Douglas. Four on three. Douglas, bicycle pass to carry. Too fancy. Papalik sana kay Pettigrew. Pang-layup na yun para kay Harvey Carey. He just wanted to be unselfish and get his teammate back on track. Fonacher did not want to risk Romeo blowing by him. Ends up giving up the foul. As Teo Campo comes back on para dito naman kay Washington. Remember, Washington made his first attempt. It was a three-point shot. But he hasn't done much offensively after that. Castro, he's also been able to get out of the way. He's also been able to get out of the way. He's also been able to get out of the way. Romeo, and that means screens that he's using with Romeo. He's very shifty, you know, as playing as a two guard. Mamaril gets it over to Romeo. The two are going to be able to get out of here. He goes cross court. Tringle shifting directions. Back to Romeo. Fly by move. Step back three. Bang! Again, a mistake with Jason Castro. Larry would never do that. He'd just be there, hands up. But okay, yun ang kanyang instinct ni Jason. I'm going to try to block the shot. Eh. Pero nga, utakan siya doon ng konti ni Terence Romeo. Dalawang pumpuntos na para dito kay Romeo. Douglas, gustong atakehin yung defense ni Terence. He wants to use a sight advantage. Feeds Pettigrew on the other side. And he goes class to drop the deuce. Mautak rin maglaro talaga si Douglas. Eh. Court, good court vision. Good recognition of the defense. Pettigrew now with a total of 21 points. Pringle for three. Rebound to Del Campo. Douglas over at the other side. Semera trying to stick close. Pettigrew off the curl. Kramer and Mamaril right there. He gets the basket. Make a Solomon foul. Napawi na naman niya ng Token Tex ang kalamangan kontra sa Global Ford sa patuloy nating pagtutok sa ating PLDT Home Devolution 
PBA Governors Cup. Nagmumula po kami sa loob ng Smart Araneta Coliseum. Umpisa pa lang ng isang napakatinding PBA weekend na naman do kung saan dadalhin tayo hanggang Pampanga bukas at balik dito sa Big Dome sa linggo. Yeah, so there are a lot of good games coming up for us. Uh, Sunday, I think it's Marapo. Stop going up against uh, Radio Shine. He's trying to climb back uh, out of the uh, cellar there. Well, they're half a game ahead of the Blackwater team who lost to Naralco earlier tonight. And then after noon, it is going to be the matchup between San the Miguel hottest team in the PBA, the San Miguel Beermen, taking on Barangay Ginebra. Famous with a block, but Ganuelas Rosser is there to clean it up. At bago ngayon, doubleheader na yun sa lingko, dito sa Big Dome. Bukas po, nasa Pampanga tayo. Alas 5 ng hapon, sa Angeles University Foundation Gym, it is going to be the Kia Carnival taking on the Star Hot Shots. Marvin Haynes from the baseline contributes those two points. May bonus ka pa kay Marvin. Maganda na dumipensa, nag-rebound. Ayan, naka-jump shot pa doon sa corner. Castro from the outside. Hagos di gumalawang nito. Talk and text on top by three points right now. A ton of three-point shots being made by both squads here. Famous down the middle. Well, kinausap ni manager Bonnie Tan. No? So talagang medyo naging agresibo dito si Famous. Eh. Actually, that would make the team owner, Mikey Romero, happy. Because he has a team here. They have a good team here. Famous with the board. Romeo pushing it. But Ross are keeping in step with him. Famous asking for it. Jared has the baseline shut on him. Hayes sa kabila. Puta tayo na mag KRDO. Daglas on the breakout. Two on two. Iiwan kay Castro. Jensen right there. Castro blows by. The finger roll is good. Pinigyan siya mo na ng hesitation. Ito, walang hesitation. Dere, derecho. Attack the basket. Madaming nagsasabi, Doc, mula na pumasok sa Stanley Pringle dito sa PBA. Actually, bago pa pumasok sa Pringle sa PBA, baka daw Jason Castro Jr. ang dating nito. Well, he's, yeah, he, he came in as a very mature player that's gonna be enough at uh, either traveling or offensive fouls. Pero yung lapat ng katawan, pati yung bilis yeah. ni Pringle, yeah. na ikukumpara, no, Doc? Yes. As we take a look first at this tatak hall scene move of the game, hatid sa atin ng hall scene. Panatag ka pag hall scene. Omar Krim coming back into the body, giving Romeo a rest. Balik na naman si Bakay Famous. Famous sneaks one through. Almost lost his footing there. Nagre-reklamo si Petty Cruz. Hindi ko daw siya doon. Well, they don't have anybody to guard him if he can get close to the ball. About a 16, yeah, 16, 16-11 player. Castro flips a pass over to Rosser. Douglas was trying to locate Petty Cruz. Madulas ang kamay. Sabi sa kanto, butas ang kamay. 86-85, time out muna tayo. By the way, ang ilis ang pupuntahan mo. Yes, Doc. Distrito ni Kuching yan. Baka maging guest mo pa yan. Aba. Congress mo ng first district yan. Ang ilis magalang at saka nabalakat yata ang kasama mo. Pakain ka na si Sixi Kuching? Pumatukan lang ako. Hindi. Marami pa pakain sa ikaw. Si Kuching. Ano ba yun? Baka lang kasi usually practice nila sa umaga. Eh, no? eh, hapon naman ang laro mo. Baka umuwi yan. Siyempre, eh, Sana, mga, kita -kita to. mga ano niya, constituents niya. No? Yan ang ginagawa ni Ramos. Whether he makes it or not, he's got to impose a will for this team. And that's going to open up those other shots from the uh, smaller players that they have that are really good Caribbean players. Labing-anim na puntos na ngayon para dito kay Jared Famous. Tatlong abante ng Global Court. Deo Campo only with four points so far is trying to contend with Hayes. Tapi ka ng bola, susungkitin ni Famous. Pringle to Graham for a long one. Bam! Ito pa talaga ang three-point shooting itong dalawang kumpunan ngayong araw. This is basketball that we love to see. No? Ah, okay. It's not that they're not playing defense. So they're not going to pass the He's making better offense. They're playing better offense. Eric Rue, Babawe, Tima Kua. Kaya with a running start. Famous now. Ano na. Crime trying to weave through traffic. Pringle na sa kanyang kaliwa. Don't throw it in again. Famous on that baseline. Goes reverse! You can't guard if they have no big man there in the inside to protect against Famous. They might have to use Kelly at least to come in and give them some support. 18 points in the game now para dito. Ki Jared Famous. He scored only six in the first half, though. Klabing talawa na dito sa third. And karamihan nun mula nung kinausap nga siya. Yeah, yeah. Ni team manager Bonita. Yeah. Unang-una, inalis siya ni Pido. I'm not happy with what they're doing. As 
We take a look first at this fast break brought to you by Smart Live More. Minsan yun naman diskarte ng coach, no? Dok yung aasa, kailangan mo pa rin naman asahan as you go along. Pero hubuti mo lang sa dali ang dali. Buka dito, panorin mo lang. Yeah. Especially to an import, you're very vulnerable to being replaced. <laughs> Uh, this team, Nakita na niya, pangatlo na siya. This team can go far, you know. Uh, they have plenty of time to replace. Ayun nga si Kelly, pumasok na sa loob ng court. Kasi uh, he can't have uh, Pelligrew keep on guarding Famous. So he just continuously killing him. Tignan natin, good day derecho, global court dito kay Famous. Look at Kelly pushing him out of his comfort zone. Yeah, now he's a little bit farther out. It depends on them. Then the health defense will come. He's on that back door. Trying to locate Buenafe, ball slapped out of bounds by Del Campo. Now that depends on how good you are in reading defense. You see where the defense is giving you. You got to throw that ball out quickly to your safety player. Kriam on the attack, loses it on the way up. Ball is with Buenafe. Inabot ng foul. Very lucky for Buenafe to pick up that ball and be able to fish a foul in the act of shooting. Finally, they realized that they were going to get a shot clock. Two times that happened in this game earlier on, they had no idea about the time. They were going to get a free throw earlier on, Guenafe. But he is a pretty good free throw shooter. Right there, he rattles the first one home. He's going to get a shot clock. 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 95-87, global court. Taking the momentum, heading into the final frame, but Jason Castro doesn't want to give it up that easy. Oh, well, Jason, now if he's your boss, right, you can never go on. He'll kill you with that three-point shot. You have to just fight the screen, make him give up the ball, or drive against you. Look at Kelly really fighting for that position. Nice pass. This is real. We did the defense. I'm going to try to contribute to CC Hayes. I'm going to try to contribute to CC Pido is telling Craig, don't go under, just go through the screen. Never go under. Well, if you get that, sorry, in a lot. But you force him to lay up. Up, turnover. Here comes Global Port. Try him to Hayes once again. Nice block. Oh. Try him once again, trying to clean it up. What an effort there by Guanielas, no? to block that shot, but no? they kept it alive, and it's a nine-point lead for Global. Third quarter, ito, 99 points, 90 against 90 tayo. Ano namang right on time, yung pagkakabuta ba na yun? No foul to give for Global 4. Castro on the attack. There's another screen. Castro against Kayan. Is fouled all the way up. May mga titira pang 1.5. Sa ating orasan, dito sa ating ikatlong yun. Well, that's two free throws. They had no foul to give. Can't reach in at that stage. He has to make the shot. Still pretty good defense all the way against Jason. Castro now with 27 points, Doc. Una niyang laro back was 19. Ngayon, 27 na. May isang quarter pa natitira. Alam mo, 28 na. A little bit longer. Famous has to put it up. Hindi naaabot yan. At the end of the first 36 minutes of action, Walo ang abante ng Global Fort 99-91. What a display by two of the most explosive guards we have in the PBA in this race to the top. 27 points para kay Castro. Talawang po naman para kay Romeo. Talagang nilabi ang labanan. And both of them doing pretty well from three-point territory. Plus two-point territory, perfect pareho. We expect a lot more of that matchup head to head. Sa pagbubukas mamaya ng fourth quarter of action.